Welcome back guys, it's Kids Coding Playground here, and today we're back for another video called The Failure Breaks Game. We'll be making a Failure Breaks Game on scratch. The objective of this game is to survive as long as possible. If the player drops to zero, then the game is over. Player, The player can collect hearts to refill HP stars to get more points, and power so you can sh shoot out lasers. So anyways, um, have you ever heard about the game called Failure Breaks? It's a pretty cool game, I sometimes play it. And as you know, this video was sponsored by Failure Breaks and um, Sponge Games. Well, I was just kidding, psych. And it's not. Sadly, we don't have a sponsor. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Let's get to the next thing. So, um, Failure Breaks game. We'll be learning these following concepts from scratch. Variables, loops, broadcast messages, custom block, custom sprite, control sprite with keys. And we'll be jumping right into the video. So I'm going to go... Demo the game, full screen it. So as you can see, it says please select the card by using left and right arrow keys. Please click space when you're done. I'm gonna play some cool music. Um, so you can just like select a skin. So I am gonna select blue, because blue is my favorite color. And as you can see, these hearts give you um, 20 extra HP. And these stars just give you points. They don't really do anything. And then you can also shoot these crates and then so you start out with 10 lasers and then um you can also gather lasers by looking at these power ups right here i wonder yeah so then the rocks can be killed so in this game uh soccer ball it takes one hit to kill the soccer ball and um and one hit to kill the crate also it takes three hits to kill the wall uh three hits to break the motorcycle and rocks i believe it is three two and yeah basically that's the game it has some decorations on the side too i'm going to show you how how you die so i'm gonna pick a different skin to show that this all the skins work so i'm gonna take purple and I'm, I'm trying to die, I'm not gathering lives, so I'm bumping to the rocks. They lose you 10 lives, so bam, I have 10 more hearts left. Hit the crate. As you can see, you flip over and you die. So basically, yeah. And that's what the game is about. So um, I started a new project, and I am going to say some things before I start. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment in the comment section below for what else um, content you want. So you can also basically share it with your friends. So yeah, let's delete this scratch cat. It's the first thing. And I'm gonna get the convertible sprite. I actually have it in my backpack, I think, um, right here. So let's just drag the convertible sprite first. I'll show you some things from the convertible sprite. As you can see, there's costumes, and I um, had some a few costumes, like yellow, purple, blue, red and green so yeah so you can make a new costume if you want just duplicate the older costume and just change it a little bit so you can also um change like the color you can make it all wacky i don't know what you can do but you can be like um like orange or you can just do like a um so let's just you just have to do this and then you can also make a darker color this is optional but you can make a darker color and then put this and this a darker color and you can also use this you can also use like basically this you can also do this to make some cool skins too so anyways i'm gonna start getting everything i have in my backpack so convertible is in the sprite library so you can find it and um we have i have a backdrop so i got this from the math racing game so yeah you can just take the backdrop you got from the math racing game and the backdrop you just have to uh, write a hp type of thing and um i put a star and a power up and put a star and a power up so yeah star hp power so anyways i'm gonna drag the rest of the things the rest of my sprites inside so i have a motorcycle i uh, this is also in the sprite library I just need the obstacles, but there is some things inside the motorcycle. So all these um things are all in the all um all 
all obstacles and they're all one sprite so it's crate soccer ball rock rocks two wall more soccer balls. so yeah so we will have these sprites in the links in the description in our google drive so i'm also going to drag some other things like the um decorations i guess this is optional but you could use it and i have a heart i think there is a heart and scratch already so you could also use that i also have a laser i think the laser is also you just have to name it a button just button and then you just color it uh, i think it's already colored like that and yeah so it's basically almost all the things we'll have so for the costumes the costumes is also the star and the power up which is which is just a lightning you just color it um pink so yeah actually we drew this a lightning but there is a lightning in the sprite library let me search it up for you guys lightning like that you can also do that and yeah change the color i don't know you can do anything but there's also some other code that we that we need like we're gonna work on the player first on part one and we're trying to cover some easy code in the beginning so yeah so when the green flag is clicked let me zoom in a little bit it'll set hp so we're gonna make a variable h hp so yeah set hp to 50 Bro. So I do have a testing. Uh, so I do have a testing limit, but I I, I would actually do a hundred. But you can do like more if you want. And you also need to make a new variable. So set score to zero, and then all you have to make laser and set lasers to 10. Well, you can put infinite if you want, you can put a million if you want, but I'm using 10. And also, you can also, I have a written coordinate, so it's go going to here, that's fine, anything's fine. And a point in direction, 90. And we'll switch costume to convertible one. So convertible one is the um, green one. So you can just change it around and with your skin. So yeah, now set, say, please, say, please select a car by using left, and right arrow keys. Um, please click, please space, press space when you are done. I'm gonna make it five seconds. And then I'll broadcast a new message because we don't even have any messages. I guess I'll wait, um, select a car. Yeah. And then um, I'll also be working on a little bit more code. Like when I receive select a car, it will go forever. You need an if then statement. If then the key right left arrow I meant um uh, key left arrow is pressed it will uh it will um switch costume to to minus a minus so switch costume to costume number minus one. So I'll tell you what that does right now. So costume number minus one. So basically that's going left. So the costume number will go left. So I think um, behind the green is the 
purple, no, I mean yellow, so it'll switch to yellow basically. And it'll wait until, wait until the not key left arrow is pressed. So it will not be as glitchy. So yeah, and um, also you need to duplicate this and you can also make the right side, which is slightly different. So let's just right and um, switch costume to costume number plus one. Plus one. So plus one is red, I know, I think. And it'll key right arrow instead of left arrow, so yeah. Um, it'll wait until, and it will broadcast, and, and you also have to code the um, space bar, sorry. Um, so you gotta code the space bar. So it's really different from all of this, but I just duplicated it for quicker use. And you do not need the uh, switch costume number. So we can throw that away. So it's costume number, not a um, key space press. And it will broadcast start game. And stop the script. So you can, you know, so because you're using right and left arrow keys to move your car, you gotta start stop the script. So then it will not change skins, basically. And also we have some other code to do. So I'm gonna show you the skin stuff. So it says, please select a car by using left and right arrow keys. Please press space when you're done. And bam, 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 So all those colors, okay, yeah. And we're also gonna have some other code for moving. So this should be simple enough. When I receive start game, it will uh, go forever. If then the left key arrow is clicked, then it'll change X by minus 10. So go to the right, left, left, left. Sorry, uh, um, minus 10. And it'll also you set to duplicate this and this will be quick right arrow and instead it's 10. Oopsies. And then you also need an if then. If then statement, if then. So for the up and down arrow keys, there's a little twist to it. So you need an and operator. So it will key up press, so it will not. So I'll tell you after when I'm done coding. Key up, up arrow, and um, you need um, if the 880 is greater than the Y position, l less than the Y position, then it will, it, then that, that's basically code. So it will not go, if it's up, so it'll let you go up, but it'll not let you pass this green grass. So that's uh, basically like a border. So that's a coordinate. So it, yours could be different, but yeah. So uh, mine is just like this. So change Y by 10, and you just have to duplicate this. Oopsies. Duplicate this, throw this away, throw this away. Put this inside of here. Instead, you gotta change that to down arrow, and the Y position is, so I just gotta take this out, and it's just a little bit different, so. So we have to use this one. So, um, if the Y position is greater than negative 90, so it's a Y position. And it'll change y by negative 10 instead. So we can just have that, have that 
in there. And we'll be also working on some other code we have here. So, sorry about this guys. Um, this is actually right arrow. I forgot about to do that. So it's left, right, up, down. So let's see. So as you can see, it works correctly. So let's just start the game working correct. So yeah. Okay, so I'm also gonna show you um, it will not be able to cross into here or here. So I'll show you, see, look, look, so yeah. I also have some other code to do, like when I receive, start game, will go forever. And if then it's touching the power up, so we do have the power up here. We're touching power up. The broadcast got power up. So yeah, broadcast got power up. And it also, I must have some code to do. So when I showed you the demo, I had some trees. So we'll be coding this and this will be the end of the video. So when the green flag is clicked, we'll hide, I mean show. And when I start the game, when I receive start game, then I'll go forever. It'll go forever. It'll go next costume. So I do have some costume for tree, trees A, trees B, trees C, tree costume one, basically costume two, costume three, costume four, Costume five, costume six. So you don't have to have at, as much as I do, but you can do that if you want to. We'll give it in the Google Drive and the links in the description, like I, what I said like earlier. So, and it will go to a position. So make it go to here. I'll repeat 50 times and change X by minus seven. So that's the trees and we'll be working on the other things on part two. So this change X is to make the trees go backwards to make like looking the cars going forward and it's not set X, it's change X. So um, we'll be doing the rest in part part what two. We might have a part three, I, I'm not sure. But yeah, so then we can finish this game. So. I'm, I'm gonna select the skin, how about we select red? So as you can see, trees moving. And yeah, that's basically what it is. So when you're not done coding, we will finish the rest later. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment in the comment section below what else videos you want. Thank you for watching, see you guys.